Kicking Horse Coffee in British Columbia, Canada sells 60,000 pounds per week of award-winning coffee. 11 single bean varieties and 7 different blends it produces using a rotary batch mixer from Munson Machinery. The best-selling fair trade organic coffee in Canada for 13 years in a row. Kicking Horse uses only organically grown Arabica beans from the best coffee growing mountains in the world, explains Tom Hoyne, manager of the roasting department. We sort our beans by the region in which they were grown and roast them for different times and different temperatures before we blend them. Previously, the roasted beans were blended using a wire type blender that badly damaged them. This was unacceptable since our goal is to produce the world's finest coffee. We had seen a Munson blender at a trade show and were greatly impressed with it. So Munson was the first company we called. After roasting and manually weighing the beans, we transport them in aluminum bins to the Munson stainless steel rotary batch mixture, which has a capacity of 110 cubic feet or 3.1 cubic meters. A forklift positions the bin directly over the blender and a slide gate is manually opened for the beans to discharge. Bulk density of the beans varies by geographic region, by the different conditions under which they were grown, and by roasting time and temperature. But the Munson Rotary Batch Mixer produces a thorough blend in just two minutes regardless of any variations in bulk density. The blender rotates continuously even while the beans are being loaded. So there is no stratification or waiting until all the beans are loaded for the mixing process to begin. The blender's tumble, cut, turn and fold mixing action blends quickly and thoroughly without damaging the fragile beans. Once mixing is complete, the drum continues to rotate and elevate the blended coffee towards the discharge spout, preventing stratification and promoting total discharge of the batch. We run batches as small as 780 pounds or 353 kilograms and as large as 2,600 pounds, which is 1,179 kilograms. But the mixer can handle even larger batches. The same aluminum bins we use to transport the roasted beans to the blender carry finished blends to the packaging line. Before packaging of the blended coffee in traditional bags that we form ourselves, we brew a small sample for taste testing in a process we call cupping. We also analyze each roast with near-infrared energy at specific wavelengths to make sure it's perfect. If not, it's never packaged or sold. Because the blender discharges 100% of its contents and does not generate dust, there is no need for cleaning between batches. We simply make sure the blender is completely empty before adding a new batch of beans. We can hear as few as one or two beans rattling inside the blender, so we know for sure when it's empty. However, we do thoroughly clean the blender once a week using a biodegradable surfactant to remove any oils that may have accumulated on the inside surface. This is the only time we use the optional side doors. We chose not to add the optional internal spray line when ordering the mixer because none of our products contain liquid flavorings. From the beginning, Munson factory personnel and our Munson representative have been quite helpful. And the machine has run flawlessly from day one. See the full range of Munson mixing, blending and size reduction equipment at MunsonMachinery.com.